Toggle the paddler co-op. <laughs> Well, hello, it is one o'clock on Friday, June 9th, and I am here at the Paddler's Co-op. I'm doing a white water course this weekend with a whole bunch of really cool people. I'm super excited. Uh, most people aren't coming till a little bit later. Uh, Jenny and Tyler just showed up, so they're here. And uh, I just got my campsite, so I've got to bring all my stuff over to the campsite. It's not super far. And uh, I'm going to start setting up. Well, it's 2.30 and uh, got everything set up. Um, we got here, we figured out a plan. Tyler and Jenny's site was kind of by the parking lot. So I invited them to set up on my site. And um, so we just got like our tent set up and everything inside and then it started pouring. So it rained for about a half an hour. These guys got their tarp set up. So we're just gonna have some lunch now quickly. Uh, I got a sandwich turkey with uh, herbed vardy. Uh, it's left over from a little charcuterie I did a couple weeks ago. And um, yeah, it's on fresh Italian bread. And then I stopped at Henrietta's and I got myself this, I don't know what it is, it's like a chocolate Danish. It has custard in it. So um, I'll, I'll gladly insert a picture here. I also got a chocolate croissant, which I already eat. And uh, in here I just have some snacks. I got some chocolate chip cookies, some chocolate covered Oreos, and some sour cream and onion chips. And then all the rest of my food is in my car for now. Bathrooms are back there. I requested closest to the bathroom. <laughs> Cars are over there, not very far at all. And uh, I think we're going to set up the shelter there. Jenny and Tyler got a new tent. What is it, Jen? The Durston X Mid 2. The which? The Durston X Mid 2. That's a mouthful. Yes. So, where did you get this? How much was it? Online. You guys are both sleeping in there? Yep. Wow. You must be really friendly. <laughs> <laughs> you know so it. Jenny's using my new flex tail. Well, it's not new anymore, I guess. My flex tail right. pump, hopefully, I to know if it's gonna... fill up the thermo rest. Let's One take a look out. at your tent. Fly, oh, nice a little vent over there. It's pretty neat looking. So this probably wouldn't be the best tent to have if you're camping on rock because you have to, it's like the pyramid tent, like my, my solo winter tent, right? Like you have to stake down yeah, yeah. No, this is definitely all four corners. And then we have the, uh, the freestanding ones for that. And then there's a pool here. The hmm. Oh, mosquitoes are coming in. Sweet. Mm -hmm. All right, we've got the Eureka No Bug Zone CT11 set up. This is my first time using it. And uh, it's pretty cool. I like it. It looks a lot bigger than the other one I had, but I think it's just taller. I know it's taller. And I really like the style of it. We'll see how it does. I'll keep you posted. Oh, I'm here with Ben Beauchamp. You're going to do what? Oh, I, I want to hear all about the tomogamy trip. Oh. I'm, I'm inspired. I don't know if I want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I've been telling stories all day already. You missed them. Ah. Uh. Ben no, just arrived. It's a little after four. Yep. Doing the solo course with me. Yep. We're the only ones. Me and you and Joe, who you just met. Oh, right on. Yes. Okay, so we got three. Yeah, he Sweet. came last weekend, I think he said, and um, he didn't get to do it, so now he's doing it. Right on. So, anyways, we will see you a bit later. Yep. What's, talk about my tent? What do you want to do? We're just sitting here shooting this shit. We're I having the can, best time. You want to da do a dance? <laughs> I don't have any moves. So My uh, followers would love that. They're used to just seeing me just all by myself. Christina seems to have a, a problem with the amount of pegs I use for my tent. This tent is crazy. <laughs> what is this called? Uh, this is the MEC OHM2. It's just the basic two-person tent from Mech. Um, it looks a little bit like um, one, two, three, a spaceship. Four, five, six. There's no clips, guys. Okay, I don't. I'm used to Eureka tents, so you guys can fill me in on these other things because I don't know this. Um, I'll have to check Jenny and Tyler's, but I have like clips that attach. But these ones, this is more like a fly coming out all around. 
and it doesn't really attach. Does it attach the tent anywhere, Ben? Um, no, it doesn't. You miss, you oh. miss one here, buddy. Yeah, I, I'm missing a peg. <laughs> oh, I give you one, but I'm missing a peg too. Yeah, let's look inside. I haven't got my bed set up or anything. Oh man, you're a slacker. Get the rain it. came, I had to throw it all in. Would you like to borrow my flex tail pump to fill up your thermos? Okay, sure. Jenny and Tyler checked it out, so I thought we'll get people to test it out because they gave it to me for free. Actually, yeah, they did. I thought I paid for it, but I'm like, no, I'm not. But I do really like it. I would say so if I didn't, even if they gave it to me for free. Yeah. But it looks pretty cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it so far. I put it through the ringer and it's, it only has like one or two tiny little holes. How long have you had it? I think two years now. What are we looking at for costs? I think I paid somewhere around 300 for it. I think 350 maybe. You paid for it? MEC should be giving you this time. <laughs> right? Look at the promotion you're doing. All right, I'll see you later. Thank you. <laughs> So it's five o'clock and we're just here checking out the boats. Yeah, that's, that's um, <laughs> these are like some serious, I don't know. They're really weird looking. There's foam in them. Is this what we're using? It's a canoe. I don't, I don't really know what a whitewater canoe looks like. I mean, I guess I do now. <laughs> oh no. I was, uh, Ben, can you tell me anything about these boats? So all I know is that, uh, well, can you see? There's my new, brand new Prospector 15 over there. Ooh. That's not outfitted at all yet. It's it's bare bones. Is it a whitewater canoe? Um, it's yeah, it's it's so a. It's not like my H2O. Like you wouldn't. Yeah, like... yeah, it's T4 Max. It it it, it can handle white white water. Oh. Um, but it's more of a tripping canoe. Okay. Shout out to good buddy Evan LaFive. Evan LaFive, um, he's he, coming tomorrow. He recommended uh, this Dagger Genesis because it. Um, is the closest whitewater style boat that is outfitted that they have to my Prospector 15, which I will be paddling in whitewater in the future. But not this weekend? No. But no, you I'm brought, not scratching up a brand new it, boat in the first did week. Did you just pick it up or why did you bring it to I bought it yesterday. Oh. Yeah. And uh, so I brought it up because I'm actually camping with, uh, with Evan uh, next week. Oh. So I'm not even going to go home from then and now. You guys haven't checked out Ben Beauchamp's YouTube. I'll put it here so you can <laughs> take a look. He makes some pretty cool videos. Thank you, Christina, and thank you for the Jolly Rancher. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I like those. What kind you got? Uh, I don't know. It was an orange one. Mango. It's Mango. my favorite. Mm. Well, it's only quarter after five on Friday. The course hasn't even started yet, and um, it's just been a great experience so far. Everybody's talking to each other and checking out everybody else's tents and setups and helping each other get all their stuff together, and it's pretty cool. It's really nice. Nice to see. All right, Ben just checked out my Eureka Midori. What are your thoughts? I think it's good. I, I like. I would have to test it out myself to, to give a full review. Uh, but from what I see, I think I would like this better than my own tent than what I've got. Um, strictly just because of the, the hammock in the top. Uh, here. The gear hammock is like awesome. You could put a lantern or a I flashlight up there. I put my up light there. up like, there. I film. I put my light up there, and then I film. It's great. And three pegs, you said, right? Um. Front vestibule, four. Front four. vestibule, back, back vestibule, and then the two sides. So that's four compared to my 12. Yeah, that's a lot of pay. Well, because I have Ben's attaches here, this comes out. I have a little clip here, but Ben's comes out like it's a longer strap and it comes out and attaches to the ground. Whereas mine just, see if I can do it with one hand while I'm filming. That'll be a true test. <laughs> it's pretty tight because I have the door open. <laughs> clip. Anything else? I think that just about covers it. How's the Jolly Rancher? Still good. <laughs> It'll last like a 1K portage if you don't suck too hard. Yeah, I'm chewing it. It's the last thing. <laughs> yeah. oh, here's a shot of our camp. <laughs> uh, my tent. Jenny and Tyler's tent. My new bug shelter. Ben's tent. Yeah. Wow. So, okay. When you like hooked it up, when you had the... <laughs> what, what, what happened? Did it break? Oreo in the mouth. <laughs> Trying to explain. Oh, it was a cookie issue? 
Yeah. Oh, I thought the rope broke. Technical difficulty. Oh, it's up there. Yeah. Okay, that one. They're so thin, I can barely see them. Like, you're looking for this, guys. It's a common super problem thin. in the camping community. I mean, it's like usually graham crackers. But... <laughs> <laughs> so, you do your little, like, loopy guy, right? I, yeah. brought, I brought a gift. Oh, this is pretty awesome. We came to visit Riley, and everybody's pitching in to help them set up. They have this awesome tarp set up already. And I think Riley and Ben set it up, and they were pretty much uh, the whole uh, group here is helping Ben set up the bug shelter. It started raining again, which it's not supposed to be, but nobody's complaining because. We've got forest fire bands on everywhere because it's so dry here, so everybody's grateful for the rain. Say hey, hi, Jenny! <laughs> Evan LaFive oh, said the tree is like supposed to be <laughs> this wide, right? Not so close, Ben, my God. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, guys? <laughs> How many people to take that hang up? I hope, uh, I hope Christina's not in your way, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on! What's happening? It's a three-person Midori. Did I know you had a Midori? I don't know. You, no, you brought a red MEC, red and white MEC. Oh my god, it looks like mine, but like, like bigger. This is my, the tent I loan out to people. There's a lot of flat, nice flat spots over here. <laughs> what you do? This looks so weird. Why? Because it's so big and I'm used to seeing it so small. Yeah. It's strange. It's really weird to see oh, it in this see. size. Yeah, no. <laughs> Lots of uh, gear talk going on here. Just hanging out and uh, chit chatting with everybody and waiting for everybody to come. And uh, it's been really fun so far, regardless of the rain, which we are all happy to see. I feel like it's a Sorry, longer what? drive. So the co-op is just down on that end on the other side of where those trees are straight ahead from here. The building sticking up? Uh, yeah, past that, yeah. And we are doing what? Here? I These? don't know. It's oh, up to your instructors. Me. They'll either take you here or to the top set. Like, you can walk up and then they'll like, yeah, you'll see the wave. You'll be running this whole section. <laughs> Christina's face. Oh, that's a good one. <sighs> okay. Cool beans. Well, it's 6.45 and it's been raining like pretty much consistently for most of the afternoon. We had like maybe an hour reprieve and it was pouring quite a bit. Um, everybody that's here so far is set up and Riley had a great idea. I went to visit everybody and asked if we wanted to come see the rapids where we're going to be doing this course and uh, so we all got in our cars and drove over. I didn't drive because I've had a, a beverage already. <laughs> I drank like this much of my beverage but um, so yeah so everybody's kind of checking out the situation. I'm not going to lie I'm nervous. Really nervous. I don't like white water. I think you guys come up with so everybody's looking at the rapids and talking about lines and where they're going to go and I'm just like, oh, look at the water, it's so pretty, look at the trees, oh, there's a bird. <laughs> I have no clue. Alright, it is about 7.30, quarter to 8, I don't know, something like that. Anyways, we were late coming back from the rapid tour. Uh, I just brought a nice fresh Kaiser with some ketchup on it. I did bring some mayo, but I don't think it's any good anymore, so I'm not using it. I cooked a hamburger on my barbecue yesterday, so I just heated it up, put some cheese on it, got some nice fresh tomato, and that is my dinner. Tyler and Jenny over here eating some pizza dias. Pizza dias. Yum, yum. Mm -hmm. What do you got, Tyler? Pizza dia. In the works. Sauce, pepperoni. cheese, sauce, and? cheese, and pepperoni. Pizza sauce, pepperoni, cheese. 
Slow down. I can't catch up to you. <laughs> I've got Sorry. it on zoom and I'm like, ah. uh. there you go. And then you fold it in half. Yeah. Oops. Just like a quesadilla. Yeah. Yummy. Enjoy. Good morning. It is nine o'clock on what is it? Saturday, June tenth. Standing here with some participants of the course, taking solo with Joe today and Ben. I think that's it. And we're just waiting to get our equipment and stuff. I got my spacesuit on, and uh, we're about to get wet. I don't want to do that, but we'll. Okay. We find the little site, like I said, the site itself is tucked into a tiny little point. All right, you guys want to come? Yeah, so when I was about seven years, I had my uh, kayaking, I had a double blade. So I had my kayaking level one, level two, and a single structure. I did commit certs one to four, that's about all of my community. Yep. Um, and I find myself in a lot of places, like I just sit on the bed when you're ever You end up in some white water and you, you know, there it is. <laughs> yep. And sometimes there's no portages around it, so I just, I want to be... Um, I want to learn how to read the water better so that I can apply my paddling techniques. So. Oh, you're going shoulder method. The head method wasn't. Uh... <laughs> Riley knows me well. <laughs> I don't like it. I feel like that is like wet. Yeah, you want to go put it back up? We were shown and then asked to practice our forward stroke and offside stroke, but I was having a really hard time getting comfortable in the canoe because we had to kneel in them. And with my injured knee, I just couldn't concentrate or focus or work on my strokes. Well done, I guess. I wonder if they were, I wonder if they were trying to do <laughs> instead of me, or it worked out perfect. Oh, hi. Hey. Awesome. Yeah? No, I, I can't. My legs don't. Sit that way. Ooh. All right, it's 11:30. Um, haven't been able to film much because I'm not focused on that. Um, just said that I would film whenever I got a chance. So we all just did the swim. Um, it's kind of a test that you kind of have to do. It's just like a wet exit and kayaking course, and um, everybody had to get in the water and go down the rapids by ourselves, like just body only, and. Uh, it was fine, didn't have any issues with it. Maybe it was camera <laughs> Christina. It's too bad to know, right? After I could not tell the watch. Yeah, I wanted to watch. <laughs> but I'm not gonna be able to watch. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it was nice knowing her. One last person around the circle tonight. Yeah, exactly. We only get through looking faster. Nicely done, Christina. I'm having a hard time, like sitting in the boat um i didn't i didn't even think that i have to kneel and uh, i have a really bad my right knee has had surgery twice and it's really hard for me to sit on top of my leg um it's really really painful so i'm not sure what i'm gonna do um as soon as i started trying to sit in the boat i was like i'm not gonna take the course i'm just gonna stay at camp and whatever i don't care lose my money but I want to learn as much as I possibly can, even if I can't do it, so that's what I'm going to do. Anyways, everyone's just standing around chit-chatting. We've reunited with our group from last night, and um, the other group is staying at the campground. They just went all after us, so they're the ones going through now. And uh, I think we're going to head back to um, camp for lunch. Ah, the life of a YouTuber. Friends Jay and Sherry over there from Beauty of the Backcountry doing some filming on our lunch break. I see you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so 
I'm now being instructed by Finn <laughs> in a inflatable pack raft, pack raft um, using a double blade, which is my thing. And um, I was gonna just not do the rest of the course. These guys came up with this idea, which is amazing. So we're here at, what is this section called? Finn? This is Jessup's Shoot. Jessup's Shoot is what it's called. I've done it about, what, four or five times. We've done a bunch of different maneuvers here. Everybody is here from the course, just doing different things. And um, then we're gonna go down the river, up the river, and do some other stuff. So that's it, super happy. Taylor, hi Jenny. You guys going next? I can catch you. I have permission to use my camera for a few minutes. <laughs> Everybody, there's Mark. How's it going, Mark? Nice. Feeling good? Very good. There's Mike over there. And then we have another Mike. That's Mike and Heather coming down right now. Okay. It's really good to practice over that. Here goes Tyler and Jenny. We ran the river with Finn going in front and me going behind. Unfortunately, there's no video footage of it, but it was a pretty fun time and I got really wet. I didn't dump though. All right, it's seven o'clock on Saturday and finally eating dinner. I should have ate sooner, but um, we're talking everybody. There's so many people here to talk to. It's just so awesome. Uh, I've got some spaghettini with shrimp and edamame in a butter garlic sauce that I made at home with some old cheddar. I just heated it up in a freezer bag in some boiling water. That's it. And it's not even really hot, but I don't care. It's good. Um, Jenny and Tyler are here. What'd you guys have for dinner? Smokies and instant mashed potatoes. Nice. Oh, so good. Well, tonight we are hanging out at Riley's campsite, which Happens to be this uh, massive village over here. It's a little bit bigger than our village, but that's okay. I like things small. There's Evan LaFive over there doing a little dancing. What are you guys doing in there? You want a taco? Can we interest you in a taco? No. Thank you. I had pasta and I ate so much. I was so full. <laughs> I actually didn't even finish it. There was just tons. But thank you. How are they? Chicken tacos. Very nice. In the bug free zone. It's good. I see you stole my neighbor away. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Got Master Chef Nevin over here. Enjoy your food, fellas. A lot of hammock camping setups here. I like the use of the helmet holding the tarp down there and together. Did you see that? Over here. It's pretty clever. Hello, beautiful people. 
Oh, hi. Hello. How's it going? Awesome. I can hear the clunk of the washers from across the campground, and I just want to say it touches my heart every time I hear one. It brings back the most beautiful memories of, like, all the use I've had with that game. There's a lot of people here. Now it's ready. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. So do we trade, or does he go off No, he's go off work. Well, oh, I get a ready to go here all ready. night. What the? Well, it's about quarter to nine, and um, we're all over at Riley's campsite. I brought my washer toss, and it seems to be a big hit. Everybody is uh, enjoying it. Got a little competition going on here, and uh, I'm about to try to get everybody together for a group photo. Do I need to make noise? It's out of tune. <laughs> yeah, play a song. I could watch this all night. This is great. Can you make it louder? <laughs> All right, I managed to get in the last game of washers. Riley's my partner, and I hope they're good because I am not. I think no. <laughs> Well, good morning. It is about eight o'clock on Sunday. June something something, 10th maybe. Uh, I haven't been filming that much. I've been enjoying myself. Um, last night, you probably just saw some video clips from uh, our faux campfire. We uh, had everybody together at Riley's campsite last night. And um, Jay brought out his guitar and did some singing, which was amazing. And, as well as Evan and Ben Beauchamp and uh, Jeff and lots of singing and guitar playing and it was really awesome and uh 11 o'clock we called it quits everybody went and headed to bed and i had a pretty decent sleep last night I've been up a few times uh in the privy not having a great morning but that's okay um i have no idea if i'm doing anything today if i'm staying if i'm leaving uh last i talked to carrie yesterday um who does all the organizing here uh, she asked, she said they were looking for an instructor for me for today, and, um, I don't think they're going to find one. It didn't sound very hopeful, but, um, I just said, I'm totally fine with what I've learned. I had a one-on-one -on -one instructor all afternoon yesterday. Um, my instructor, Finn, said that, uh, if it was a sort certif of certification course, he would have given me a pass on a level one. So I felt good about that. I, I've come here and I've learned what I wanted to learn. I uh, got a little bit more confidence with the white water, um, a lot more confidence with the white water actually, learned how to read, learned a whole bunch of the terms and all that stuff and had a really great time with everybody here. So um, whatever happens today happens, I might head home, 
Uh, I might do some paddling with Riley. I don't think I have uh, access to the boat. I don't think they're going to give me a pack, uh, a pack raft to take out if I don't have an instructor to go with me because it's like a liability for them, I would, I would assume. Anyways, I'm going to keep packing and uh, I'll update you later if I am able to. And um, see you in a bit. Well, I'm just standing here talking to Carrie about the day, and in comes babbling Brooke Smith. <laughs> babbling as I arrive, of course, because that's how I roll. And you're bubbly. <laughs> I think you should be bubbly. Bubbly Brooke Babbly. Smith. Babbly. Very effervescent. What are you doing here today? Um, I am playing on Palmer Rapids um, with the, the crew, like a dozen of everybody. Uh, Riley, I think, is the lead, and we are going to run some laps. Nice. That's it's awesome. <laughs> Aww, sounds exciting. You have a good time. I was, I'm oh, so wow. happy to meet you finally. You too. Off social media. So just wanted to have you in here and uh, show everybody your lovely face. So. And all the bugs. And all Can the bugs. you see the skeeters? They're not biting. <laughs> they're not, thankfully. No, they're not. Thankfully. I'm literally good. Still, Amazing. So. Amazing. Have a great day on the water. Oh, I will. It's nice to meet you. You too. Great. Have a great day, guys. Uh, you awake? Yes. <laughs> a Where were you last night, sir? Sleeping. Yeah. Were you? Yeah. How could you sleep through that? Oh, I haven't had a day off in like a month, so. Oh. And uh, it's been a long stretch, trust me. <laughs> oh, enjoy your day on the water. Yeah. Miss you guys. Oh, here's my solo group going out for the morning. to go back to camp and finish tearing down my tent. Thanks for everything, Emily. No problem. Have a great day on the water. Thank you. My solo instructor. Here's the tandem group getting ready for their day out and uh, a couple people missing from the group today have decided not to do the course today. Well, it's 10 o'clock in the morning, <laughs> sitting here at the campsite with Joe and Tyler and Jenny. Just having some hot chocolate. Everybody's taken off and they're out on the water and now the sun's coming out. Uh, we might walk down to the rapids there and see them from the shore. Or we might just sit here and do nothing. It's kind of nice just chilling. That's all that's going on. Hi. Jay and Sherry from Beauty of the Backcountry. Because Janie and Eric. Eric, also known as EJB Greybeard, EBJ Greybeard, I never get the initials right. We just came down to see everybody run the last little rapids. We just got here right in time and everybody went through, the solo went through and then the tandem. So we got some footage for them and uh, I'll put it in the video, you've probably already seen it. We're getting ready to head out. We're going to stop for some food on the way home. How was your weekend? It's good. It's good? Perfect. Yeah. Are you yeah. sad about missing today? No. No? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good too. No. I'm totally good. I know any day on the water is a great day, but any day hanging out with friends is a great day too. So thanks so much part. for camping with me and hanging out on my site. And uh, 
Uh, we're going to be doing a trip sometime this summer, so keep an eye out for that. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. See ya. Thanks so much for watching. If you like what you saw, please click the subscribe button. Also click the bell for notifications. If you'd like to get more information on the stuff I use on my trips, please check out my website at camperchristina.com. Thanks. Bye.